What is poppin' everyone, it's Big Bath, another video. Today we're gonna run a Paragon mod, and this one's going to be for the Sniper Monkey. Yep, that's right, we got a Paragon for him. Uh, now, I've been wanting to do a lot of videos with the Sniper Monkey, <clears throat> such as God boosting him, making him 555, stuff like that. The issue is that this man, uh, kind of lags a lot, and, uh, I actually do believe that this Paragon is going to lag a lot. So that could be a problem, but I'm hoping it doesn't lag too much. We definitely got to get a farm up though. I can't uh, waste too much time with that. Let's put a farmer down with it. And we got to upgrade this as fast as possible. Luckily, the sniper monkey is pretty good at soloing. Definitely one of the best towers in my opinion. Well, maybe not late game. <laughs> but um, until then, yeah, it's pretty good. All right, let's do this. And maybe you guys are thinking it's good, like, I, I don't know, I don't know. The thing is, for me, I just feel like, if it can't defeat a bad, really, then it's kind of not that good. But, I guess the sniper monkeys kind of can, at least better than a lot of towers. But, I don't know. But we'll see how, if this man could actually, like, solo for a long time. I think he can, but either way, we're gonna have to place down three, so if he can't, we'll just do that. Alright, there we go. So far, so good. So things are starting to get past a little bit. Let's just clear out these houses first. And let's put down another sniper. Alright, so this one will do the middle path. There we go. And our bank, well, I guess our farm, is doing real well. I wanted to try out not going bank first and see how that does. But let's see. Oh my god, this bank is seriously going off. Jeez Louise. Let's, how much money is this making per turn? Let me check. Or per round. Alright, so we're at 38,400. It gave over 10,000. Jeez Louise. Alright. Oh, I did not realize uh, it was around 40. Alright, so we just beat easy mode, which is nice. Now let's do semi-automatic just to make sure this man doesn't lose. An elite defender, large caliber, let's give him a night vision goggle. And let's do elite sniper to mainly power up our other one. Let's make him shoot faster, give him a few upgrades. So I think we're not going to have to upgrade them pretty much at all from here. Let's get the bank started. Now, I'm wondering if the bank helps too much because uh, I don't know if it gives us income itself, like it gives us more uh, with the 555. I think it does, though, to be honest. All right, so far, so good. So far, so good. Banana Central. We got Monkeynomics going. Perfect. There we go. So we have the middle path upgraded, the bottom path upgraded. Now, let's do another one for the top path. And we need uh, just over half a million cash, which should not be too hard. I mean, if you guys see my other videos, you, you know that we just did a tower recently that cost 3.4 million. So this is nothing compared to that, as you guys know. All right, so far, so good. There we go. And we can do it. Let's do it. Elite Moab Crippler. Let's see. Let's read this man's description. A fast-firing, smart Moab crippling rifle can deal with almost anything. Sounds good to me. Let's speed it up a little bit so we can get to a round where he starts to have trouble. And look at this man. This man's just firing the machine gun. Uh, and I know that that has to be hitting hard. Like, this man's getting tens of thousands of pop per second, which is pretty crazy. Alright, we are almost at 100. Let's just skip to 100 real quick. Alright, there we go, 100. So here's a bat. He didn't destroy the bat as fast as I thought he would, um, but see, that's the thing, it's a sniper, like, bats aren't really his specialty. Alright, let's do degree 100. And let's do degree 100, set it to round 200. Round 200 is kind of like one of my benchmark tests, right, because it's where we get the fortified bats, and uh, we'll see how he does. 2.3 million so he's doing damage but it's not enough because as you see there's another one coming this is not good this is not good this is not good for our sniper oh sweet neptune 
come on destroy it quick if he destroys it i think he'll destroy the things that come out very quickly but it looks like he cannot destroy it uh oh you know what we'll do instead we'll go into sandbox mode real quick <coughs> and i want to test some things out because i think that the strength of this sniper monkey doesn't come from it taking on fads I think it'll be specifically good at taking on other things. Uh, such as grouped, pretty much anything other than a bad. I think he could take on grouped balloons very, very easily. So we're just gonna upgrade him. There we go. Elite Moab Crippler. There we go. Degree 100. And what we're going to do is test out some grouped round 200 fortified ZUMGs. Let's try it. And now that I think about it, this might cause a lot of lag. And as you can see, it definitely is. But let's look at his pop count. He's already got 1.5 million, which is ridiculous. So I definitely think he's pretty much hitting all of them. That's why it's causing lag and whatnot. And as you can see, they're barely moving forward. This is literally 100 ZOMGs. That's what's crazy. This is literally 100 ZOMGs. Come on, you could do it. Come on. Is he going to pop them? Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys. Well, I think we know that he will pop it. So what we're going to do now is do DDTs. Let's just do like 30 just because I don't want it to lag too much. Oh, 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 okay, that was nice. See, that was nice. All right, let's do 100. Let's do 100. Bro, th okay, this man is actually really good at taking on group balloons. He's actually really, really good at it. And I'm assuming he could take on all other kinds of balloons, obviously other than Moabs. It's not just the stopping effect, but you know, let's try it out. Let's do a round. 400 500 grouped fortified ceramics let's try it yeah see this is nothing this is nothing to him he's just one-shotting him yeah so that's nothing probably should have assumed that let's do round 400 uh ddt's let's just see oh no <laughs> bro it looks like it's like lagging or something oh my god oh my gosh no he can't do it he cannot do it all right, let's do round 300 DDTs. Come on, come on, my boy. Come on. No. Is he going to be able to do it? The thing is, is he's, look out. Okay, look, look how much he's hitting. He's hitting like all of this line right here. All the ones that are stopped, I think he's hitting. Oh no. Okay, yeah, he didn't beat those. I think he was either hitting them or that his stuns are lasting so long. Let's just see how fast he beats the lowest tier balloon on is. I want to see this. Oh, my, my game, my game. I would do the highest tier balloon Arius, but I'm probably going to do some kind of video on that or something. Oh my God, the lag. See, but this is what I'm talking about. It causes so much lag. So I think he beats that. <laughs> I think it's safe to say that he beats that. So anyways, guys, that was the uh, Paragon Sniper Monkey, a.k.a. the Elite Moab Crippler. So, I'll see you guys next video. But next video, I think I'm going to start the grind for Bloons Tower Defense Battles too. I think it's time to get into Hall of Masters this season. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But until then, I'll see you guys later. Bye!